with my beautiful wife. My beautiful wife. And let's eat. Let's eat. Lemon sorbet. We bought it in Costco. Mm. That's one of our favorite sorbet. Mm -hmm. mm. mm. Very nice. Ah, tastes amazing. Yeah, we're trying to avoid the brain freeze, you know. <laughs> okay, my sandwich is falling apart. Whoops. See, you hold it here, you hold it here, see, you hold it in many places. Mm. Support the top, support, support the side, support the bottom. Mm. Mm. Yum, yum, yum. Mm -hmm. This girl is before night shift. Mm. And we're having with Avril early morning tomorrow, which is our favorite kind of morning. No. Mm -hmm. mm, that's so good. Yeah, mornings are tough. Zombie. That woke up in the morning. And I call uh, it call it being zombified. I don't know. <laughs> that's how. I don't know. Is it even a real world? I don't know the word. I don't know. I call it zombified. I did recently many day shifts. So I'm like, oh man. <laughs> mm -hmm. And she calls mornings zombified. Being zombified. Uh, not easy. Not easy. Mm -mm. And Ariel has physical activity in the morning. This is the hardest part ever that he does. Mm. Everybody chose to do stuff, so. Mm. As long as he chooses it. And he enjoys it. Mm -hmm. The only thing that he do doesn't not enjoy is it's the morning when I'm trying to wake him up. And the only part that Yeah, this kid doesn't wake so up hard. <laughs> if he wakes up if he wakes up by himself and it's good. If not, mm. Yeah. Mm. Oh, it feels so hot today. Mm hmm So like must look high moisture. Or something. We, I don't we, know. We did a lot of physical activity today. Yeah, we did. Not we a bite. lot. We biked today. Not, not a lot, a lot, but... Just 10k. Nothing special. No. I had lots of fun. 10k is not too much. But it's fun. We've seen Mama Bear in a cab. From selfish distance. Seen... Ducks with baby ducks. Oh, so cute. Yeah. Blue heron. Mm hmm. <gasps> okay. Okay, that was a big mistake. I released the grape on one of the Leave sides. No, no, no. Bad idea. Not. We used to have those buns. Years ago, and they had triangular shape. Do you remember? Mm hmm. And the same buns. Is it the same bun? Mm hmm. I still remember the triangular shape. Mm hmm. I think square is more friendly because you can put so many. Well, okay, practical, exactly. Not friendly, practical. But practical is friendly. Yeah. When it's triangular, it's pretty hard to make a sandwich out of it. Mm. 
so nice. Yeah. We have a new portable um, gas barbecue. So we're ready for the summer. Mm. For camping, for picnicking. As much as we love um, charcoal, the little mm -hmm. charcoal one. But as soon as fire ban hits, we can need to use it. the charcoal. Um, we can't use the charcoal, we have to use the gas one. So we prepared. And fire ban hits quite often here, quite early in the season. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Meanwhile, we're enjoying it. Oh man, come on. I'm sorry. I was doing so well at the beginning, and then there was it. And then I found somehow the grip on this, this thing. Yeah, when you loosen up the grip, that's it. Mm -hmm. mm. Besides, the gas one is so much easier to use. Less work, but the flavor is not there. You can say it's only one, but flavor sure. charcoal is better, and the wooden charcoal is the best. Mm. Oh, guys, you have to excuse me for this mess. <laughs> yeah, so good. Mm -hmm. Probably. Totally, totally love it. You love it? Mm -hmm. I love citrusy flavors. In the general. I love the lemon sorbet. I love the texture. Always did. Mm -hmm. Even more than me, I think. Yeah. Mm. You love said it. you don't love the texture? I love the texture. You love the texture? Mm -hmm. Like very, very smooth. She's not a big sorbet girl. Mm -mm. I think me, I love sorbet and Aria really loves sorbet now. I'm more of the ice cream girl. I love the creaminess. But I love the texture of this one. It's really, really smooth. Mm. Wonderful. Apparently there is a gelato place. Mm -hmm. In Vancouver, mm -hmm. it serves more than 200 flavors. Of sorbet? Different ice cream, sorbet, you know. Wow. That is a lot. Mm -hmm. Like it's a full shop of um, whatever you really... But just to choose, I think it will take two hours. Like, oh. Let me try this one, and this one, and this one, and by the time you're oh. done tasting 20 of them, okay, I'm done. <laughs> no, we'll start from the beginning. Right? And go all over to try the ice cream. I think it can be very nice. Yeah, but seriously, I think he tries to... Oh, after the 20 flavor, oh, you know, you they know, can't tell you leave the store. <laughs> when I was, I think, 18 years old, I went to, to Italy. To Rome. I've been there only three days. Unfortunately, we need to do the come the big comeback. And uh, we went to gelato shop. And gelato shop had again. I'm not sure how much, but it was like you know meters over the meters of the meters of um, stands of gelato in three four rows. And uh, it was so hard to decide which one to go for. That it was unbelievable. I even not remember what I. It was experience by itself. It was like a huge amount of... Mm. 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 I love the citrusy lemony. They used to have an orange one, didn't they? Yeah. I think it was different brand. Mm. I remember years we ate lemon, orange and the coconut. Mm -hmm. I think that's it. No, there was something else. Was it something else? No. Was there a fourth pineapple? One? Oh yeah, you're right. There was a pineapple. 
small pineapple with frozen. True. Yes, there was a pineapple. I remember that first time I made this type of ice cream. I even remember the restaurant. Actually, we've been next to this restaurant. Um, it was on Dadu in Haifa. On Dadu, one of the restaurants there. Oh, really? Under, um, under one that we went, like uh, one of the smaller restaurants. And they served this type of ice creams with coconuts and, um, you know, and I remember as a yeah, teenager. Some... Oh, that was many years it was ago. my one of my first love when I first time saw it in Canada. Do you remember how excited I was? And I bought like the box and I was like so excited. I don't know what would we do without Costco. Mm -hmm. What would we do without Costco? With all this stuff they bring Apparently in? Apparently, in the United States, there is Sims Club that people love even more. Some people, not all. I don't know. Well, since we're not in the States. Yeah. We not limited Sam's. options. We don't have Sam's Club here. And I'm not sure we have Sam's Club in the, over the... The other side? The other side. Oh, the, uh, the other side. The other side of Canada I mean, or the, uh, south of the border? South of the border, I mean. I have no idea. Like, we're such a big shoppers that honestly I have no idea. Vancouver is about one hour from the border. Yeah. Like something about hour from the border. We Probably are no, Vancouver is longer. Vancouver is longer. We are about hour. We're about an hour from but, uh, Washington State. Yeah, I'm not sure. I have no idea. I never even heard about that store. No, I heard. I heard about it because you know what? I love my YouTube channels and I'm watching you know shopping, <laughs> food shopping and different you know halls, food yeah. halls and. Yes, yeah, I don't know how you do that. <laughs> I don't know. It's enough that sometimes we have to do shopping like today, but it went to a few stores. I'm like, yeah, okay. That, that was good. <laughs> I'm good for I got my fix of the stores for a long time. Stop, like, please don't do it too much. Please don't do it too much. Please don't do it. <laughs> yeah. But in Costco, we didn't do too much. No. It was the other shop. Yeah. Yeah, oh, I'm so thirsty. Me too. So yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you for joining us. It's always a pleasure to have you with us. And please have you tried those type of uh, ice cream and sorbets that stuffed into the you know rinds of the fruits? Yeah, good question. Did you? Do you like them? Because I do. Mm. Nice, honey. So yeah, thank you so very much. Yes, and please subscribe, write us a comment, thumbs up, or send your slime. And remember, go to what you enjoy and do something fun every day. And we shall see you tomorrow.